hello friends how are you this is my new and first channel this is called technical skills and today i want to show you some technical uh, skills related softwares like hypack i think you all should hear the name of hypack hypack is a hydrographic uh, or dredging software you can perform more that's something like uh, dredging and uh, monitoring uh, all sorts of bathymetry in the river or other uh, water bodies as you mentioned so before we started uh, i have to uh, describe something uh, related to this uh, hypex software uh, uh, i want to now started to show the software this is my hypex software my cursor indicates the icons here and uh, i don't uh, uh <coughs> sorry um, I don't here describe the installation process. If anyone have some problems, uh, then uh, I would uh, demonstrate him how to install uh, these softwares. And uh, feel free to ask me uh, uh, if you need these softwares or not. So now I have uh, started this software. Here it is opening. This is the interface of Hypex software. We have seen that uh, there is lots of uh, coordinate systems uh, and uh, before I going to this uh, here in my just uh, look at my cursor here is the grid showing that it is coordinate system is UTM North and ellipsoid is WZ84 and it, it lies in zone 46 and uh, distance unit is meter. You, show, you can customize it uh, through the um, various aspects just like uh, if you insert uh, going through this view bar then you can show these sorts of color bar color editor and north error and something like this okay okay now before i go to more details i want to in this tutorial i want to show you how to you uh, plot some excel data or some uh, water dev or some bathymetry data in this software so I want to show you how to you eat this. Before starting this, I now want to show you that uh, how I process this source of data from text or Excel format, just like this. So that I want to go into my pro locations where uh, this data is situated. Okay, I want to go. I want to go my directory my project files and here is the utm under money channel utm and here is the shorted data look at that here is a text file just uh, indicate named short spot level corrected so i just uh, opened it and show you which formats data hypac reads the first column is easting and second column is northing and the third column you have seen that it is obviously and the RL or depth uh, formatted data. You can use uh, either elevation mode or depth mode in this um, software. So here it is. Uh, here it is in a depth mode. I just opened it, uh, and uh, before I started to do this, uh, you have to um, you have to convert this TXT file into XYZ format so that you I can project it into my software. So I go into my main window of high pack and here here this is called geodesy this uh, earth signed uh, symbol is called geodesy if i click it then i have to see okay i'm just waiting i have to see lots of uh, coordinate systems are available here here i am using utm north if i, I click this one then uh, there are lots of uh, coordinating system so you can uh, insert uh, the, your desired coordinate system from this social data. If there is no one, so that you can uh, just simply select none. Then here we go. Then uh, we, you can see this is uh, uh, this. You should be insert your desired coordinate system as specified as. Here I am just uh, using uh, the UTM not coordinate system. So I just cancel it. Okay, and uh, there are 
there are you can see lots of tabs this is project manager this is project item and palette palette is uh, something like that the uh, data ranging system you can uh, just uh, simply you can just uh, simply set this uh, according to your data range you may see, uh, first of all to do this uh, i prefer that uh, you have to see the uh, highest and lowest coordinate uh, highest and lowest uh, rl then uh, you set these sorts of band there are lots of uh, bands uh, in this system just uh, like um, if i want to select set bands and i have to insert minimum and maximum depth and i can select this sorts of increment when how many times it should increment the data just like it is minus 10 and then after 0.2 just like 9.8 then there is an uh, range okay okay just simply i ignore it and does not go to the my system here you go first of all the project manager project manager i have to uh, go that uh, before starting that uh, you i have to show you some demonstration on the file tab if you increase click that then there you can see some new project save project and other project if i click new project then it will directly go to my c drive uh, projects where this software is actually situated uh, you can also customize it through the set group location if i set group locations then it will go to my desired group location okay just i can go through this uh, in a uh, very details just i am talking about how to i insert this source of data here so here is a tools option then you can uh, see that universal input this is uh, not a built-in uh, tool i have to insert it uh, uh, externally if anyone need this then i will uh, provide you this tools just simply you can uh, see this tools and if i go to that universal tools then here is here comes a window just like this here is lots of files uh, extensions uh, here i need uh, first uh, at first i have to say that uh, the text file should convert it into xyz format then you should go to that input file format this should be must be in a text txt format so i am going through this and then i go to navigate through short data then there is a spot level corrected you can insert this then you have to go this and then again short level there is another short level corrected i have to rename it as version 2 okay there it is and then go to read by field here is you can uh, first of all uh, if you remembering that my text file contains x y and z files so that i check out all those things and then con click simply convert okay now we go to exit and then here you see there is a shorted data files okay just uh, you should uh, click on this plus sign and then uh, you should uh, break out this so i now want to add this uh, uh, look at that it is already added here if don't if it is not inserted into the shorted file data file system then you have to insert it from add files okay in both process you have to add this so here i simply check out this okay look at that these files are visible here okay here is the files and uh, the data file format is um, uh, the color palette is just showing uh, just the one more thing you can uh, see that uh, it is uh, only shows in uh, color black there is a uh, no palette color is uh, inserted it if you want to do so the color palette so that i want to show you how you did this how you have done this to do so you have to go to that uh, go to this um, setting plot and then uh, there is a tab called soundings have to grow that soundings and then color it indicates only black if i click this and color by depth through this palette ping order then if i apply and click ok then you have to see that color is automatically changed through this part. okay that's it um, so this is uh, my first uh, tutorial regarding this uh, high tech software and uh, after that um, in the next tutorial i want to show you how to uh, process this sorts of uh, data if there is uh, if uh, there is some uh, 
correction needed or uh, or something required to add then i will also show you how to add it and uh, then uh, next to next class uh, i have to uh, i will show you how to process this source of data or some analyzing types of data just like uh, i if i if you want to um, plot contour or uh, dem then it is uh, too much convenient uh, for uh, for this source of software it is not uh, so ambiguous uh, just like then uh, just like uh, arcgis or uh, other such software it is uh, too much um, user friendly so till then it is a goodbye and if you like my videos uh, then um, just uh, subscribe my channel and uh, like it thank you and bye bye have a good day